This video will cover the topic, Graphing Rational Functions with Holes. When graphing rational functions, there may be times where a result is undefined. This happens whenever the denominator is zero. And whenever this happens, the number is undefined. If this occurs when graphing a function, a vertical asymptote occurs at this point. What is a vertical asymptote? Vertical asymptotes are vertical lines that are at different values of x depending on which values of x make the denominator equal zero. Usually the function either grows or shrinks significantly around the asymptote, but never reaches it, since the function is undefined there. Let's try an example. Graph the rational function f of x is equal to 2x plus 6 divided by x squared plus 4x plus 3. How do we know at which points the function will be undefined? That's a great question. Since the denominator can't equal 0, we will find the values of x that make the denominator equal to 0. It will be at these values of x that the function is undefined. Since x squared plus 4x plus 3, which is the denominator, is equal to x plus 1 times x plus 3 through factoring it, we know that the zeros are x is equal to negative 1 and x is equal to negative 3. So, so it is at these two locations where a vertical asymptote may occur. Now we need to plot the rest of the function. We can do this by having a couple of different values of x and then solving the function for those values of x. Those numbers that we will get are the y values corresponding to each x value that we have. By plotting these points that we have here, we get this side of the graph. However, we're not really sure what happens on the other side of our second vertical asymptote, which is that x is equal to negative 3. So, in order to plot the rest of the function, we need to have values of x that are less than negative 3. So, when we let x equal values that are smaller than negative 3, such as negative 4, negative 5, and negative 6, we have y values that are also quite small. When we connect the dots, we get a function that looks like this. You may be wondering why this part of the function cuts through a vertical asymptote. This is an example of a case where, while x is undefined when x is equal to negative 3, no vertical asymptote occurs there. So, at the point where x is equal to negative 3, instead of having a dotted vertical line, we have an open dot. And that means the function is undefined there. So, this is the graph of the function f of x is equal to 2x plus 6 divided by x squared plus 4x plus 3. Okay, so first we need to find where the possible vertical asymptotes will be. Then we solve the functions for some other values of x, so that way we can plot the rest of the function. Is this correct? Yes, it is. Excellent.